I want to call people here who are facing divorce. Run forward here. Let's break that spirit. Run forward. If you are facing calm, you are facing divorce. You are facing divorce. Huh? Where is your wife? She's in Zimbabwe. She, Zimbabwe? She yeah. You are facing divorce? Yes, man. Please, course. another one come. Yes, yeah, man. Is this one? Y yes, man, of God. Eh? You want y to divorce? Yes, man, of God. Eh? No, I don't want to divorce. But she wants to divorce you? Yes, man, of God. It's a demon. Can you see that? Can you see divorce? If you are watching, you are divorcing. It's a demon. Demon. My brother, why she want to divorce you? Uh, I have been cheating, man of God. When uh, did you stop cheating? <sighs> you have never stopped. Yes, I've never stopped. Why are you coming out? Eh? You want to divorce who? Eh? You want to divorce this one? Why you want to divorce him? She's crying. People are cheating a lot. Eh? They are cheating, cheating. Cheaters. There are many cheaters. I, I want to have a service like this. They are, you see she's crying. Brother, are you cheating? Yeah, I used to. You are cheating, eh? Mm. So, you, see, she wants to divorce because she found out you are cheating. Even you, you are cheating, but you have not stopped. Yeah, yes, Where is the lady know. you are cheating with? Uh. They are uh, in best where, where is it? It's like she doesn't want to talk. Where is, where is the person you are cheating with? Oh, she stays in Pretoria. Huh? She stays in Pretoria. So why are you cheating against this lady? But I made a uh, decision to quit. Huh? I made a decision. I quitted everything. You want to quit her? I quitted the cheating. I had to tell the lady that it's... When did you quit? Uh, last week. That's when I finalized everything. You people, you lie too much. Eh? I, you people, you lie too much. How can we pray for you to stop this? Here you are carrying on. My brother, you say what? I was saying you can pray for me. I, 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 I won't lie. You, you, were you cheating? Uh, I, I cheated once. But it was because, men of God, it was because she was... All right, let's leave it. Let's leave. You are speaking the truth. Yeah. You are speaking the truth. Uh, can you answer me? You? Uh, for me, man of God, there's, there's a lot of girls. It's just some of them. It's just one night nice stand. What are you doing in the church? Are you a Christian? <sighs> yes, there's a the church that, that I was going to, and then the church shut down. And then I started drinking and smoking and going to clubs, are you, then uh, I've been meeting different girls. Yeah, you, you, are, you are in the world. Yes, you yes, man world. of God. So why are you troubling this lady? Because I, you've got many ladies everywhere. Uh, I need God. Uh, I need God to deliver me. God will deliver you today. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name. Come on. Out, you demon. Out, leave him. Oh. Even in the lady, you can see even the lady. Out! Oh. Living! Out, oh, spirit of cheating! Another one is coming to join you. Maybe it's your boyfriend, girlfriend. Who knows? Out! Oh. Come here, brother, come. Spirit of alcohol. Spirit of alcohol. Come on! Spirit of alcohol, you are free. Rise up. The problem you have got too much friends. Yes, it's true, man of God. That's the main problem. And you can't control those friends. Stand up and please lift up your wife. Ask forgiveness. Ask forgiveness. The way you are asking forgiveness is like you are trying to rob her again. Please. Don't, don't kiss her. Ask, ask forgiveness. You are very fast. You are, you are, always you are very far. What, what are you saying? Call him. Call him. Call him. 
You, you, her name is Koa. Uh, Adelaide. Eh? Adelaide. So how do you call her now? Babe. Eh? Adelaide. Call her with a, a better name. And you ask forgiveness. She will forgive you. She's ready to forgive you this week. Babe. Don't call her. Let's hear what she said. Huh? It's okay. You say what? It's, it's okay. What you need to do, my brother, you understand? Change a starter pack. Yes. Take that starter pack, give it to, to her. Yes, man, of course. Because you are connected too much. Yes, man, of course. Yes. Yes, I'll give it to her. She's asking for a starter pack now. Amen. Stand up and appreciate God. Dog. Can you help him? Can you help him? Who, who knows how to remove the starter pack? Please come forward, you remove for him. He, he can do miracles and make it to disappear. Take the phone from him. You take the phone, you remove the starter pack for him. Ah, you Amen. can't hear what I'm saying. My, my brother, break, my sister. You took it. Eh? Are you changing starter pack? Yes, man of God. There's another one. Uh, there's a Celsius. Hey. Hey. Ah, we are more. What do we wish I would know? Uh -huh. My sister, do you have them? Yes, yes. Yeah, put them in your mouth. Show them. Just, just show them. If we don't do this, I'm telling you, this brother, his friends, because he's coming from friends, you know, yes. from friends, they will call him. Later, you find that he's back there. Tell yourself you want to follow Jesus. It will work for you. Yes, man of God. Thank you. So, you have a beautiful wife. Yes, man. So, God. don't make mistake. God loves you. So, you yes, can take God. Jesus. Do you want to accept Jesus? Yes, I want to accept Jesus. All right, let's give you a pastor. Come this side. Go ahead, stand that side. You accept Jesus. And uh, let's go to the last one. Why are you cheating to your wife, my brother? Uh, it's not like I want it, but uh, I, think I, I believe it's an attack because I remember when we visited the synagogue last year. You visited the synagogue? Yes. Okay. When I was there, I, I felt like nothing ever happened, but after some time when I came back, I found out that I blocked the lady. I, I don't even have a feeling of calling her anymore. But in the main cause, because it's, it's like I'm still fighting the feeling. Are you a Christian? Yes, I am a Christian. Where do you go to church? I go to the house, household of Christ. And what are you doing there? There I'm just uh, part of the church. I'm not doing anything. That's the main problem. When you, you go to church, you understand? If there's nothing to do, pray for that church. Yes. Don't be a member who just go to church. Mm -hmm. If you've got nothing to do, if you've got, you just go to church, you'll find something. You'll, when you're worshiping, you'll be looking around. Because that's what you're normally doing. You're looking around who's beautiful than your wife. So from today, when you go to church, tell yourself, yeah. after this, okay, I want to pray for this church. They've got nothing to do. Yes. Okay, let me do something in the church. You'll realize that, okay, this character is there to stop what God wants to do with you. Amen. You understand? Yes. So when did you stop cheating? Uh, the time I, I came back from synagogue, I stopped completely. And then after some time... You, you went back? I went back. When did you stop now? Now I stopped because... Uh, when? I stopped uh, last week. That's when I finally uh, cut everything. No, you didn't stop. I didn't. I, I blocked her. I even went to her and tell her, you know what? No, 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 this no, no, no. You didn't me. stop. I stopped. <laughs> no. Do you think she has stopped? 
No, he hasn't. He has not stopped? No. How do you know? Say. Because uh, last, uh, last week he said he stopped. I was in Sunagog with his grandmother. She can't walk. I was there for two weeks. When I came back, I found messages from a girl. He deletes, but then she was calling him. And then I took his phone. Then she was sending messages. Are you not also cheating? No, I've never cheated on it. Huh? No. You never cheat? Huh? She never cheated. She never cheated? Mm -hmm. no. But why are you doing that to a wife like that? Uh, that's even the reason why I made a decision saying Let no. me pray for you. So, you don't have the number, the messages in your phone? I deleted her. I even went to her personally and tell her this, it has to end. Please, can you go and call her together when you are with her? And say, you remember what I told you? Yes. Eh? Yeah, I can do that. She will tell you why. I said, I told you that we have relationship of is finished. Yes. When she's here, go and do it outside I of the church. It. Go and do it together. Go it. Go together because this lady will never trust. Let me send someone. One person can go with her. Can, can you just send one person there to go with her because uh, this brother is intelligent. My brother? Yeah, uh, we, we were going to the same church with, with him. You were attending the same church? Yes. You know him? I know him, yes. He was very close to the pastor. Where is the church? It's close to the pastor. Yeah, it's in Kempton Park. It's close to the pastor. Yes, he is, yes. So, now you are making our pastor to be like, he's a sinner too. No, I'm not saying that. I'm just uh, stating. No, 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 no. I'm not saying you're saying that. Can you see you're close to the pastor? And now, you people who are close to pastors, can you live a right life? Because at the end of the day, it's like we are doing what you are doing. So, how is he close to the pastor? Uh, his brother is one of the pastors there. They are very close like this with uh, the, the senior pastor. Where do you come from? Is it not Zimbabwe? It is. Mm. So, you people, you want to say, people have to accuse you by saying, you are coming from Zimbabwe, Zimbabweans are doing this. And where else is you people? God loves you. Uh, where is the lady? Uh, she, she ran away to Zimbabwe. She left you? Yes. You still want her? I do, yes. You don't want another one? I don't want another one. Were you not cheating? Uh, man of God, I cheated only once, but it once. was... Yes, once. What were you doing in the church? At that time, I was, we weren't really going to church at that time. We were just going once in a while. Okay, God loves you. Let me pray for you. People are cheating, huh? And you can't believe they are cheating. God bless you. Uh -huh. You are facing divorce? Yeah, my wife, she left me in 2016. Why? She just left. She moved on. She moved on? Yeah. She didn't tell you the reason? No, she said she, she don't want me anymore. Is it not because of your ass? No. <laughs> <laughs> Can you call and ask her what, what is the problem? Is it not because of my hairstyle or? Okay. Come, let me pray for you. Stand up. God loves you. You are free. Yes, I'm divorcing my husband. You are divorcing. Where is he? At home. You are divorcing him. Why? He's staying with another woman. And huh? He's staying with another woman. He slept. He's staying with another woman. He left you and stay with another man, woman. Yes, sometimes he, he comes and oh. every girl is his. So you're tired? Yes. Where is he staying with another woman? At home. Where? Begasford. And where do you come from? Begasford. So we need to tell him... Uh, if he's watching, he must come back to you. Don't divorce him. Huh? You want to divorce him? Did you find someone? No. 
You don't have anybody? Yes. Were you not cheating? No. You never cheated? No. Eh? No. Come. You don't want him? Eh? You don't want him again? Can you forgive him first? You give him the second chance. Come here. Everybody's attacked. This is an attack. You are free. You are free. Forgive him. Forgive him. Forgive him. If you, if you don't forgive him, you are giving me lessons to continue with this woman. Are you hearing me? Forgive him. When he comes, leave her, leave her, leave her. Leave her. If you forgive him, you are giving lessons to continue. Leave him. Forgive him. He will come now and stay with you in Jesus' name. Uh, the, the, you call. Yes, I called her and she said, Yes, I understand. I will never call. What her. is she saying, my sister? He's been doing the same thing since 2015. <laughs> I found out 2016 and then he said, No, it's over. Last year. I mean, calling thing. outside. What is it that you found? He said, No, remember what, what I told you. And then? The relationship that's over. And she said, Yeah, it's fine. She said, yeah, it's fine. Okay, come together now. You, my sister, you don't want to forgive him. Do you want to continue with the marriage? Yes or no? You are still hurt. Yeah. Huh? Are you looking for someone? No. You, wa you don't want to continue with the marriage? You are hurt. Because it's been taking me for granted for so long. He took you for granted. So now, I want to pray for you so that he must never take you for granted. Can I do that? <laughs> Can I pray for him so that he must never take you for granted? Huh? Fine. Ask forgiveness. Uh, please, just not. I want you to forgive me. I know I've been doing this behind your back, but now I made my decision and I want to be with you. How old are you, my brother? Hmm? How old are you? I'm 31. How old are you? I'm, I'm, also, I'm turning 31. Do you have children? Yeah, we have twins. Twins? Yes. yes. Well, that's why. That's why. So, God has set you free today. Amen. Are you forgiving him? Can you all stand? Say in the name of Jesus. Are you forgiving him, sister? One of the problems that you people do you don't know why we are here. And you don't know who's standing behind us. If you know why we are here, you, you won't, when we tell you do this, you'll be able to do it wholeheartedly. Amen. This is a mistake. Now, if we stand with you here, like we are proposing you now, starting relationship here, we'll end up coming out of the will of God. We, if I'm here, if I say to this man, he's blessed. If he knows, he must not look at me or look at the experience he experienced. You look at the one who's behind me. So this is the mistake you people are doing. Now I'm telling you, forgive this man. And then now you're looking at me, you just say, ah, he did this, he did that, he did that. No. Even yourself, there's too much you did for him. He has been complaining about disrespecting. Is it not true? That's so true. Eh? That's so true. So now he used that also to say he's better. Whereas he's under attack. Now I've prayed for him. He's free now. As he's free now, are you forgiving him? Yes. You must not force. If you feel you don't want him, we must not pray for you. You must not force. I must not push you. But you need to reach a level where you understand. The one who's speaking. Is it me or someone behind me? Why I gave you this opportunity to speak with you? 
This one is my daughter. This one. Yeah. So I would rather concentrate in my children than you people. Because even you people, you are just turning everywhere. You don't know where you belong. But giving you this chance now. Yes. And fight making Satan to leave you. So that this marriage will stand. We are fighting Satan. Amen. Are you understanding what I'm trying to say? Amen. Yes. Are you forgiving him? Yes, sir. Huh? I can't hear you. Yes. Why are you forgiving him? Brother, you have sinned against God, against this lady. You cheated, whatever. Mm. But if she can't forgive you, you must leave her. Okay. You understand? Uh, can I also say something? You yes, sir? Uh, the reason why I've been, even when I ended the relationship, but I couldn't come to her and tell her that I was doing this, but I've stopped. Because I knew with her heart, it, it, she, she's, she's got a, I don't know how I can say, a stiff heart, whereby it's hard for her. That's what I'm talking about. Let's leave it. Uh, if she wants to forgive you, I'll tell you, go ahead, what you can do. If she doesn't want to forgive you, because already marriage, people must separate because of fornication and adultery. You people here, you are worthy to separate. Uh, we can't push you to do that. Because already you have sinned against God. And you have sinned against each other. But God wants people to forgive each other. Now. Not tomorrow. Now. If you do that tomorrow, you are going to count each other. You are going to fight. They are still going to fight even after church. That's so true. And I, eh? I wish if there is counseling after this. Because I know we will fight. And it Why will is she laughing? She knows what I'm saying is true. Can you say in the name of Jesus? In the name of Jesus. Look here. Let me say it again. One of our problems that we are going through. I'm saying this. You have been here. You have one problem. You have go there. Another problem. You go there. So you have been going around with problems. When you come to Charis, forget your problems. Because it's, you just need a word. When I say it's over with you, can you come here? Are you not pregnant? Can you, come here. We need to pray for you. Because for marriage issue, for marriage issue, I believe God is doing it for you as you are there. Can you just come here, you? Sister, touch your stomach. This pain must stop. Jesus, Jesus' name. Jesus' name. You are free. Can you come, my brother? Yes. What we are telling you, when I say you are going to make it like yourself, God is honoring you. You are going to give us a testimony here of breakthrough in finances. When I'm saying this, it will happen to you in Jesus' name. Amen. Can you come here, brother? There's a problem of your hand. Yes, sir. Eh? Yes, pastor. You don't know what is the cause. Yes, pastor. It must not be a stroke. Let me stop it in Jesus' name. Amen. Go away from him. He's free. Can you just come Amen. here? Touch here. You are free. By me touching here, you are free. You are free because you have been searching for a job. Yes, eh? yes that's true. Eh? That's and true. God that's is true. honoring you. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Even that one there, come. Yes. The same thing. Devil is defeated. Amen. Receive your job. Yes. Take it. Uh -huh. All right. 